There are four types of DWIs in Minnesota, a fourth degree DWI, a third degree DWI, a second degree DWI, and the first degree DWI, which is the felony DWI. The higher the degree, the more serious the DWI. So generally a person's fourth degree DWI is their first DWI they've had in their life. That's a misdemeanor punishable by 90 days in jail and or a thousand dollar fine as well as other uh, DWI consequences that judges will impose if you're found guilty or if you plead guilty. A third degree DWI means uh, that one of the ag aggravating factors are present such as you had a test result over a point two zero, you had a child age 16 or under in the car with you at the time of the DWI, or you had a prior DWI within a 10 year period. That's a gross misdemeanor. The maximums are $3,000 fine and one year in jail. There's also supposed to be a 30 day minimum in jail, although there's a loophole to that. The second degree DWI is another aggravating factor that's also a gross misdemeanor with the same maximum penalties as the third degree DWI except there's also a 90 day minimum of jail again with a loophole that allows you to get it down to 30 days in jail if you plead guilty or are found guilty of that and the first degree DWI is the felony DWI in order to get a felony DWI in Minnesota you had to have had at least three prior DWIs within a 10 year period it doesn't matter generally what state they all came from, but if you've had three DWIs within a 10-year period and now you get a fourth within that same 10-year period in Minnesota, you could be charged with a felony DWI. Along with the criminal penalties with DWI, there are also civil penalties such as license revocation, vehicle impoundment or vehicle forfeiture, and license plate forfeiture, which people commonly refer to as whiskey plates. Uh, for more information about the implied consent side of a DWI, which is your driving rights and your driving record, which is completely separate from the criminal case, you should watch my implied consent video. For more information, contact me at my office at 612-339-5844 or check out our website at www.arrestedminnesota.com. That's www.arrestedmn.com.